Hello, welcome to my channel. I have two more Marie Antoinette journals for my ISTE shop. No, okay, I always say ISTE shop. ITZY shop. Um, one is embellished and one is not. I thought I'd try one that wasn't embellished. Uh, just pretty, pay, pretty cover and pretty papers, but not pockets and tucks and lace and things added to it. So we're gonna do that one first. I thought I'd put this option in my shop and see if someone was interested in it for a lower price and then they can um, make it what they want. Put the pockets all over the place. And This is some brocade and you might not be able to see it but it sparkles. I think maybe if I do it like that you can see it's very beautiful. And we have an applique behind here. Um, I put some gold metallic paint on the frame to make it look vintage -y with pearls a little bit of applique down here and um, a gold foil die cut that you could put your name put journal on there do all kinds of things with that so this just has the besides this I did I w did start to do this and so I just left it this is a tuck besides this I didn't put any pockets in this journal this is just vintage wallpaper from the Victorian era and I have um, colored some of it and I'll call this I think whatever people sell them like this they call it blank journals but I don't know if this is really blank or not but really pretty pages and you could create your own Marie Antoinette journal and do all kinds of things with it. A double doily. And if nobody's interested in it, I will take it back after a couple months and bling it up. These are I changed the colors on these. It turned out really cool. I changed the colors on these. If any of you like these colors and would like to see some of them in my digital shop, just let me know. I think they turned out kind of cool when you change some of the colors. Now that one's original color. I lightened it up a little bit, but that's an original color that they had on their walls. So, this will make somebody a really pretty journal. And the link to it will be in the description box if you're interested. Here we go. So that will be the blank one. And this one is embellished. And this one came out in more blues a little bit. Very pretty blue applique. It's got rhinestones and pearls. Oops, rhinestones and pearls. Another white applique. I put I put gems on the flowers. A pretty bow. It's got silver metallic frame behind it. A pretty aqua heart. This material is vintage um, embroidery. You, they like embroidered through there. I don't, I don't know exactly what you call that, but I cut that down to make that make that a cover. So it's got. Uh, it's really pretty and then it's got some lace pockets with some rhinestones we have a little flower a little digital and went with, I, I made these pockets on a video the actual blue pockets so it's got a little bit of lace down here polka dot lace it's shiny sparkly the little dots are sparkly this is a tuck it's actually supposed to have something in there I won't put that in there it's going to have a little digital this has, this has, is a pocket pocket this can go anywhere in the journal it's just paper clipped in there I put a little 
silver metallic on some of the pages. Real pretty doilies. A little bit of silver metallic. Pretty lace pocket. I just love this one. I don't know why. Uh, green sequins all down the edge. Kind of a green, a deep green, emerald green. A flip up, uh, vintage lace, uh, bridal lace. A velvet belly band. With the Marie Antoinette Digital. This is an envelope that you can put anywhere in the journal. Um, it's not attached. Neither of these are attached. It's a frame with Marie Antoinette behind and you can use it for your own pictures or you can put her in there and then put her somewhere in the journal. I thought I'd leave it up to you. A couple little fussy cuts. The center of the signature, these are just paper clipped in, so you can move those wherever you want, or you can attach them here, and so that would make a double tuck. Just some little digitals that you can use in your journaling. This is not attached. You can move that bow anywhere you want. You can leave it here, and you can attach it with a Marie Antoinette frame and picture of her. Another little belly velvet belly band. A lace pocket with a journaling card that I've edged in gold. Miss Marie. You call her Lady Marie, I suppose. A really pretty floating doily pocket. I don't know if you can see the sparkles. It's just paper clipped in. And oops, it's a page. And the last page has a paper clip or metal clip fabric cluster. You can move this anywhere in the journal that you want and we have some pretty lace pieces. Some satin. Just different. I tried to make it sparkly and pretty. You could use that in your journaling. And uh, So there we go. There is the journal and the links will be in the bottom. If you have any questions, just leave me a comment. I uh, don't miss too many of the comments. I always answer. So um, I really hope you're having a great day and thank you so much for stopping by and spending this time with me.